increasing by a percentage is really, really easy. All we need to do is work out the percentage of the amount and then add it on. So here we're increasing 500 by 50%. Well, first of all, what is 50% of 500? 50% of 500 is 250. So now the question is as simple as increase 500 by 250. So add the two together, 750. Increase 360 by 50%. Well, what is 50% 50 of 360? 50% 50 of 360 is 180. So I'm going to add 180 to 360. 8 plus 6 is 14. Carry the 1, 3, 4, 5. So the answer is 540. If we want to increase 264 by 50%, first of all, we need to work out 50% of 264. What is half of 264? How many go, uh, twos go into 264? Well, that's 1, 3, 2. So 50% of 264 is 132. So now we are just increasing 264 by 132. Add the two together. We get 396. If we're increasing by 10%, let's work out 10% first of all. 10% of 230 is 23. So all we're doing is adding 23 to the amount of 230 and that comes to 253. Increase 150 by 10%. Well, what is 10% of 150 first of all? That's 15. So add 15 to the 150 and we get 165. What is 20% of 350? That's what we need to work out first and then add it on. Well, 10% is 35, so 20% is 70. So it's 350 plus 70, and that comes to 420. Increase 150 by 30%. Well, we need to work out 30% of this amount first and then add it on. 10% is 15, so 30% is 45. So it's 150 plus the 45 comes to 195. If we're increasing by 5%, again, it's the same technique, just got different figures in on this slide. 10% uh, is 24, so 5% is 12, so we're adding 12 to 240 to get 252. What is 15% of 160? Well, 10% is 16 and 5% is 8, so therefore 15% is 24, so this is what we need to add to 160, so we get 184. 25%, uh, maybe you know that 25% is a quarter, uh, so what is one quarter of 48? A quarter of 48 is 12, um, so we need to add 12 to 48, and 48 plus 12 is 60. Um, this one would be quite difficult to work out using the 10%, uh, what is 10, uh, well, seeing it is two ten percent and a five percent, mainly because the number doesn't end in a zero here. But um, if you're comfortable dividing uh, forty-eight by uh, ten, that is four point eight. So we've got two four point eights and half of a four point eight, which is two point four. And again, if we add those together, we we will get uh, twelve. And again, we need to add the twelve to the forty-eight. Um, increase sixty by thirty-five percent. First of all, let's work out thirty-five percent of sixty, and then add it on. Well, 10% is 6, so 30% is 18, and 5% is 3, so 35% is 18 plus 3, which is 21, so we need to add 21 to 60, and we get 81. Decreasing by a percentage is identical to what we've just done, except instead of adding it on, you take it away. What is 50% of 240? It's 120, so here we're doing 240 take away, 120, which is 120. Uh, here we're working at 10% of 160, which is 16. So our calculation is 160 minus 16, which is, well, 160 take away 10 is 150. 150 take away 6 is 144. For this question, what is 5% of 40? 5% of 40, or 10% is um, 4, so 5% is 2, so we need to subtract 2 from 40, and we get 38. Decrease 60 by 35%, well, 10% is 6, so 30% is 18, and 5% is 3, 
So 35% is 18 plus 3, which is 21. So the calculation is 60 minus the 21. 60 take away 20 is 40 minus the 1, 39. So to quickly recap, to increase or decrease by a percentage, work out the percentage of the amount first and then add it on or take it away.